MSN spies as the can you show you can you show us the house? Well, um, I'm sure I can do that. I'll I'll give you a spin. Okay, let me spin you. There we go. So this is what I am looking at. There's the tripod, uh, big TV there. Uh, there's a leather couch. There's the computer, and that's my front room. MSN spy also asks. Do you have a family? Uh, is your dad alive? That's a, very, that's a very morbid question. And what's wrong with my mum? What have you got against my mum? Why do you hate my mum? Okay, Tayan asks, hi Yan, uh, you're British, uh, well spotted. Uh, what do you think of those uh, French people out there? Uh, right, Tayan is uh, inviting me now to bash the French. Uh, well, thank you very much, but I decline. I, I'm a citizen of the world. I won't do anything like that. And besides which, those bleeding Scots you need to watch out for. Uh, Jan also asks, do you have any pets? Right, let me show you that. Yes, yes, yes. This is my pet, this is Eric. There you go. I, I only have inanimate pets, there you go. Hello, yes, yes. Good. Darkfire101 asks, how long have you been going to dancing lessons? Winking smiley face, right? Taking the mick, taking the mick out of me, right? Oh, right. I've been, I'll have you know, I've been going to dancing lessons, uh, ballroom and Latin dancing and jive dancing for a good six years, not recently because I've been on tour and I have no social life anymore, but uh, I can sort of a bit dance. Polar Bear Math asks, uh, what's your favourite type of dancing? Well, it's the fancy dance. You can't beat the fancy dance. I love a fancy dance. Bit, or some sort of a, that sort of thing. Yeah, I like a bit of that. But a few people here have asked, uh, what's your hobby? Uh, well, I think we, we've covered, uh, I, I juggle and I, I've done that for a long time. Uh, I, I do dance and um, I watch a lot of theatre and films and things like that. I used to read a lot of books until I discovered that films beam the information directly into your head, which is useful. Okay, I've got a few people here asking me what's my favorite magic trick. Um, now, I'm not really a, a magician. Uh, I'm more of a juggler, but I have, you know, I pick up a few magic tricks, uh, as well as some mathematical magic tricks, which is called Mathmagics. Uh, I can put up a, a link to a video by a guy called Arthur Benjamin, who does loads of great stuff with that. Uh, but you've asked me uh, what's my favourite magic trick, so uh, let's hang on. Uh, by the way, this is my uh, third place from Miss Mag that I got about a month ago. Now, uh, here's an old pack of cards. This is a, a trick that a lot of you will probably know already, but I'll do it. Anyway, uh, so I've got uh, two cards here. I'm going to fold this one widthways like that. I'm going to fold this one lengthways like that. And I'm going to put uh, the first card here inside the second. So it looks like that. Put it into the second one. And then I'm going to put the uh, second card inside the first, like that. But if I do that, something special happens because if I push the king through, it turns inside out. There you go, there's the inside of the king. You can see that. And if I push it, I can go back the other way, push it through, and it's back the right way around again. In fact, if I push it through one more time, it can be both inside and outside out at the same time. I can even pull this out a little bit further, and it looks like that. Comonage again asks, uh, how many eggs can you juggle? Uh, right, let's have a look. Let's, let's find out. Right, so uh, card on the legs here. Uh, okay, there's one, there's two, three. Right, I'll put them like that. Okay. Right, you might want to step back from the screen, you know, just in case. Here we go. Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah! Oh. Okay, a lot of people have asked though, what sort of music do I like? I like uh, electronic, I like punk, as long as someone's going whoa in the song, I'm pretty happy. And my absolute favourite band is a band called They Might Be Giants, which is a rock group that any nerd would be proud to have in their collection. Uh, they do songs like uh, The Sun is a Mass of Incandescent Gas, which they've updated and corrected recently. So now The Sun is a Miasma of Incandescent Plasma. Uh, my other favourite band is a band called Polychronic Spree, who are crazy. Uh, there's about 23 of them, and they used to dress up uh, in these white gowns, like, and they look like a cult, but they just sing about sunshine and rainbows and things like that. 
Um, I like some light-hearted rock, which I call rock con. So that'd be something like Bloodhound Gang, um, uh, Bonzo Dog Doodah Band, you may not have heard of those guys. Um, I have a soft spot for bubblegum pop, uh, because I am camped as a row of pink tents. Uh, so my favourite song would probably be something like uh, Jackson 5, uh, I Want You Back, something like that. Okay, some people have asked, uh, do I watch TV? Yes, I, I watch TV. Um, um, my favourite programme is The Colbert Report, uh, which is greater than Daily Show. Um, uh, someone's asked, do I watch Lost? I do watch Lost, I'm a big fan of Lost. Uh, my favourite programme, let me show you, hang on. Uh, so one of my favourites here is uh, this show, which is Roger and the Rotten Trolls, which you may see on my channel. Uh, I put the videos up. Uh, look at this, VHS, how retro is that? And this one, I'll show you how much of a fan I am. I even had this one signed by the guy who wrote the programme. Uh, here's some other favourites. Uh, there you go, there's Bill Co. Uh, Phil Silver's show. Uh, that's a great programme if you've not seen it before. It's pure gold. Uh, another favourite of mine. Uh, you may notice as well on my channel there's a, a sketch show called Dare to Believe. I've had permission uh, to put those up at least uh, sort of verbally and informally. A Bobby series of numbers that says, Do you like video games? Uh, which is your favourite? Right. Uh, when I was uh, doing my PhD, I wanted an Xbox or a PlayStation, but I refused to get one because I would never pass my PhD if I had one. Uh, and I don't have the patience for it, I'm more of a casual gamer, so I will play flash games on the internet. But I'll tell you what I have got. Okay, I do play one of these, which is a, a Game Zone 2. It's the best 20 quid I've ever spent. It's one of those things you plug into your TV, and it's got 128 old style retro games on it. So Space Invaders, I'm a demon on Gallagher. I've spent hours on this. Um, yeah, go get one. Don't buy the cheap version, don't buy the Mega Joy 2, that's rubbish. Go get Game Zone 2, it's brilliant. Bad Splurs asked, why do we exist? That's a very serious question for what was intended to be a kind of light-hearted Q&A on YouTube. James Fez again has asked, if quiz is quizzical, what is a test? Well, I, I guess that must be a testicle. Yeah, testicle. So the, word, the answer is testicle. If quiz is quizzical, then the test is testicle. Yeah, testicle. Wait a minute. Tony J. Warner has asked, uh, why are you so cool? Uh, you really don't know me, do you? Um, that's the power of editing, I suppose. You really wouldn't say that if you'd watched me walk into a glass door at an international mathematics conference in front of a room full of important mathematicians. Um, all, all the time I thought, I know, I'll make my pyjamas nice and warm, you know, it's a cold winter's night, I'll put them in the microwave for a bit and they'll be all nice and warm. Don't do that, they catch fire. The Hungarian Cuba has asked, uh, have you ever solved a Rubik's Cube? And if so, how fast? Yes, yes, I can uh, solve a Rubik's Cube. I learned uh, from another YouTuber called Pogo Bat, uh, he's another YouTuber I recommend. Uh, okay, let's have a go. Okay, let's try it. So there's my Rubik's Cube all mixed up. Now, uh, I'm not an expert at this at all, but you know, I only learned this really as a, a visual aid so that I could teach uh, group theory to, to my students, but you know, something like that. Uh, okay, okay, look, I've got one white line, which is getting there, uh, but perhaps, perhaps if I do something like this. There you go. Uh, that was quite quick. Okay, that's your lot, go on, hop it. 